Hi everyone, it's Matt Weaver, and thank you for joining me for your morning shot. I received a phone call from a wonderful real estate partner of mine named Gary. When the call came in, Gary said, Matt, I have a huge problem. I said, what's the problem, Gary? He said, I've been working on a transaction for a little over 40 days. I'm on the list side of the transaction, and I just got word that the buyer's mortgage lender is issuing a decline. And I said, geez, that's horrible, Gary. Gary says, well, thanks a lot, Matt. I already know that. Not to mention, the seller has already packed up their house. So Gary moves on and says, Matt, what would you do in this scenario? And I said, well, Gary, you see, this is what we refer to as a midstream transaction. A midstream transaction accounts for about 15 to 20% of my current production. And it is a transaction where the current mortgage lender issues a decline and we are referred into the transaction in an effort to resuscitate the deal. Now, the good news, Gary, is that we are successful the majority of the time. So Gary said to me, geez, that's great. Where do we go from here? Here's what we can do, Gary. Refer the client over. We'll be more than happy to quickly get them pre-approved. In fact, I built out a specific process flow to expedite the pre-approval process due to the sensitivity of these type of transactions. While I can't guarantee we can do the transaction, what I can guarantee is that all parties involved will know exactly where the buyer stands in factual form. Gary says, my gosh, Matt, I greatly appreciate you and I'll have the buyer call you right away. But I said, Gary, before I let you go, I have one question for you. Did you ask 10 and demand 15? And Gary says, excuse me, Matt? Did you ask 10 and demand 15? Gary said, Matt, I have no idea what you're talking about. Well, geez, Gary, I know I invited you to my Elevate conference. I know, Matt, I know, I'm sorry, I just don't have the time to attend. Well, I understand that, Gary. I also know that I had my assistant reach out to you to set up a refresher call. A refresher call are calls that we reach out to our partners every quarter to let them know on new concepts that we're working on. Again, Matt, I know I received the call from the assistant, but I'm sorry, I just don't have the time. Well, you see, Gary, what we cover in Elevate is Ask 10, Demand 15, which 10 represents the top 10 essential questions that you and your team can ask the buyer's mortgage lender before having your seller execute on any offers. Now, these top 10 questions won't give you 100% certainty, but they will increase your percentages exponentially. And 15? 15 represents demanding a 15-day loan commitment. So, as an example, Gary, what was the loan commitment on this transaction that we're talking about now? Well, Matt, the commitment period is left blank, so it was 45 days. So I said, okay, and when did you find out the mortgage lender was going to decline the loan? Gary said to me, well, it's been 42 days. Exactly, Gary. I said, you see, you see, Gary, lenders are only human beings, just like you or I. So the more time you give, the longer you're going to wait. So what I try and arm our real estate partners with is the importance of asking for a shorter loan commitment time frame. Also, many of our real estate partners leverage Ask 10 Demand 15 in their listing presentations because it offers sellers the peace of mind knowing that their agents are reducing the risk of transactions falling apart up front. And Gary says, wow, thank you so much, Matt. I would certainly like to schedule that refresher call you were telling me about. And I said, geez, Gary, there's one major problem. I don't have the time. Agents, if you would like the top 10 essential questions sent to you, message me or call me at 561-864-2458. That's my direct line. Again, 561-864-2458. Don't relate to Gary. Learn from him. Okay, our first ever Heavy Hitter series is coming up, and we are excited to have Mark Rucco of the Mark Rucco Group joining us. Mark was ranked the number one agent in Palm Beach County for most closed transactions in 2016, 
closing over 330 transactions and ranked in Wall Street Journal's top 200 realtors nationwide. I know Mark's story very well and can assure you that at some point in his career, you will find common ground and more importantly, stories from this shared experience that can help us overcome whatever difficulty currently preventing us from being our best self. This event is over 75% occupied. So if you would like to secure your seat, please either call me at 561-864-2458 or email Brett Vidro. His email address is b v i d r o at financeofamerica.com. Our heavy hitters interview with Mark Rucco will be held at the Cinemark Theater in Boca Raton on October 26th from 9.30 a.m. to 12 p.m. We look forward to seeing you.